So my current position at Liberty, I'm the Associate Director of Community Engagement in the Office of Equity and Inclusion. It's a humbling experience because I never thought a day in my life that I'd actually be an Associate Director. So, but, you know, actually being in this position is, is a blessing. Um, I'm growing a lot. I get a chance to connect a lot with people in the community and really help meet that need and build that rapport between Liberty University and the Lynchburg community. And it feels good to be that person. I wanted to create a reality show where it showed that Christians could still have fun. So people kind of had this idea that because you're a Christian that you can't have fun, that you can't enjoy life, and I wanted to show that from a different perspective. Six months straight from January 2016 to June 2016, I asked myself that one question, and the answers kept coming back. I want to help people, and I want to be on camera. So I said, okay, well, I already have a title, Keeping Real Shaquille. Let's just do a talk show while I do exactly that. And that's and that's how it that's how Keeping Real with Shaquille came about. And then I said, you know, I need to find a, a little catchphrase to go to it. And I said, inquire to inspire. I have the ability to be creative. So and I'm pursuing after what I'm passionate about. I'm passionate about college football, and I said, you know what? I could just start a show all about college football. And so that's how the college football highlight came about. You're gonna get a game day experience even though you're not there. You know, it, it definitely starts at home. So I'm gonna have a beautiful wife, and I'm a newlywed. Um, I realized that this time on this earth is short. So if I realize I have a short amount of time, I want to get as much done as possible to make sure I use everything I had to maximize my potential. And I married my best friend. So she's not some stranger that I just met. Like, you know, we got a chance to get to know each other. And we have a lot in common and we, you know, are very different at the same time. So I think having a good uh, self-identity, knowing your worth, knowing, having a good idea of where you want to go, but also just being true to yourself and true to, true to what you believe. And I think that that right person will come along in a time being. Y'all make a great fit for each other.